Several cars and people were washed down the intersection. Ventura County Fire says eight people were transported to the hospital with minor and moderate injuries. Oh, look. Yeah, this is Oceano Dunes in Pismo Beach. It's actually on my list of places I, well, I did want to stay, um, but I always had a little bit of issues with uh, being that close to salt water. You can see these folks actually saw that the uh, the, the bad tides were coming and they left a day early. Um, so this is kind of the last good footage of the beach here before the, the next day when the tides hit. There were some king tides mixed with a storm surge. Uh, so you can see here the, the waves started really coming in hard into the Ventura County area. Uh, this is on the California Central Coast. Uh, lots of people started getting hurt. Um, there were many people who were sent to the hospitals, unfortunately. And uh, I haven't heard of any deaths, I'm happy to report, at least not yet. Um, but you can see here it was pouring into hotels, pouring into um, you know, the neighborhoods, and of course, it completely overtook the Oceano Dunes area where everyone was camped. I imagine there were people camped up high enough who escaped it, but many people who were parked a little lower, they really took a hit hard. Um, some people kind of got stranded. Some people had to be rescued from their RVs, uh, from their trucks. I know these folks here had to get taken in for hypothermia. Um, there's a lot of damage and I got to believe that a lot of insurance companies are going to throw up the whole, uh, you know, this is off road. This is not, you know, that you're insured for highway use and road use. Um, some insurance companies will throw in a, a clause saying, you know, it's not for being off road or being, you know, uh, this doesn't count. So I'm really hoping that this doesn't happen, but I expect there'll be some people here who will have challenges to the, getting a claim filed and, I just can't imagine uh, this happening. I, I certainly will be thinking twice about being this close to the ocean in the future. Uh, the thing about the Pacific Coast with sneaker waves, sometimes it's hard to tell how bad is it going to be. You know, um, they can come out of nowhere, and it's not just water; it's salt water. So even if you survive just getting some water in your rig and such, uh, and in your truck, it's all salt water. It's it's very bad for your truck. Uh, it's very bad for your vehicle. It'll cause all kinds of corrosion real quickly in ways that fresh water wouldn't. So it's one of the reasons I've always been a little hesitant about hanging out on these ocean side beaches is just the sheer amount of salt water that your your vehicle and your, your, your truck is, is subjected to. So I really hope the folks there who uh, were in Pismo Beach and, and got hit uh, I do hope that their insurance is covering their, their loss. Um, I hope no one was hurt. I hope you didn't lose anything that was irreplaceable, you know, the, the photos, the things like that. I'm hoping all the pets were fine. Um, you, you can lose things, right? But you don't want to lose lives. Um, stuff is just stuff. Uh, and, and so uh, it's easy for me to say right now, right? Uh, I'm not having uh, my, my trailer flooded, but... Uh, you know, if this was my truck, I would definitely be a sad person today. Um, you know, but I will say this is why we have insurance and I'm hoping that these all get covered. Um, think twice, make sure to check the weather and the tides when you're out there camping on the ocean. Make sure you stay safe. Uh, I'm sure you're in the same boat as me. You wouldn't want to see this happen to you. What a terrible way to spend your Christmas break and start your new year with, with all of this disaster in front of you. So. Again, uh, heart goes out to everyone who might be in Pismo. Uh, if you were down there, I'd love to hear your comments if you know anything more about it. I had a hard time finding uh, footage uh, of this uh, event. I imagine more people were focused on saving lives and taking pictures. That's the way it should be. So I hope they have a happy new year if they can. And I hope you all have a happy new year. Let's be safe out there.